Hey, Sports and Entertainment Marketing. So I wanted to tell you about the Dis Discretionary Income Advertisement Project. You can come back to this explanation if you need to later. Um, so I'm going to tell you about discretionary income, and then I'm going to tell you about how to do word art, which is going to be a crucial part of this assignment. So um, discretionary income is what you are able to spend after you've paid your like main bills that you have. So after your income taxes are taken out of your check, and after you've, you know, paid for your mortgage and your electric bills and your phone bill um, and like the essential clothes that you have to have and things like that, what money do you have left over to spend on the stuff that you care about, the stuff that you want to spend and the things that you want to move forward in your life? So the first thing you need to do is to copy and paste um, this thing and you're going to write your name on it and say what is something that is required spending. So what is something that you have to pay before you can have discretionary spending? Um, and then this is a task that we are all going to do on the same slideshow. Um, you're going to create an advertisement for a product that you would spend your discretionary income on. Um, you're going to include the name and the image of the product, the price of the product, a need the product satisfies, a want the product satisfies, and a value that the product taps into, as well as a place where you can buy it. Um, we're kind of like integrating a lot of different things that we've learned before into this one. Um, so in order to do that, here's my example. Um, but what you're going to do is you're going to pick any of these slides. Like this is a slideshow template. It has a bunch of like random stuff in there. So when you pick what slide you want to have your advertisement on, you can delete anything that's in there. Or you can keep whatever just to keep like the font and formatting. Like, it's totally a blank slate. You can do what you want with the whole slide. It's just a slide to work with to create your advertisement on. Um, so, so here's mine. Here, I'll move this around so you can see the things. So sunflower seeds, um, the need it fulfills is to be outside and get your hands on the dirt. The want it fulfills is tall, impressive flowers in your garden. The values it supports are natural beauty, supporting birds and pollinators, and supporting local business in my community. Again, you can have whatever needs, wants, and values you have for your product, whatever it is that you would spend your money on, um, and then where you would get it from. Um, and you could, you know, have, and the place where you get it from is going to kind of determine how you structure your advertisement, um, you know, and it could be an online shop. Or it could be a, a brick and mortar store like the hardware store in town. And you're going to include the price of the thing. So word art is going to help become in, sorry, it's going to come in handy here because you can do, you can make your stuff look pretty cool. So this is word art, for example. So what I did to add that is I went to insert word art. And then I'm going to type in my words here, words. And then it pops up and I can change everything about these words. So I can do the normal thing where I can like flip it around all kinds of crazy ways if I want to. Get it back to normal. Um, I can change the font. Um, I can change the color of it. I can change the outline of it. Um, I can make it bold. I can make it not bold. I can make it italicized. Um, I can make it bigger or smaller just by like doing that, doing that. The one thing you can't do with word art is you can't have like multiple lines, um, but you can do whatever you want to do in your one line. So uh, yeah, so that's the project. So we'll work on this during class. And at the end of class, you are going to be given some money and we're going to have different amounts of money to work with. Some people are going to have quite a bit of discretionary income and some people are going to have less so. And you're going to vote on which advertisements were, were most convincing to you and made you want to spend your money on those things. Okay? That is the plan. See you soon.